When I was thinking about COVID-19 and the impact it would have on our community, it really dawned on me that we needed to take advantage of our Higginbotham Community Fund. The Higginbotham Community Fund is supported by the Community Foundation of North Texas and our employees. And so I came up with the idea of Higginbotham Helps, which simply was, how can we get dollars from our Higginbotham Community Fund, in turn get those dollars who have delivered to first responders, be it at Cook Hospital, but they've also supported a number of nonprofits such as Safe Haven, Boys and Girls Club, Catholic Charities, and also delivering meals to the Fort Worth ISD. Part of Higginbotham's value statement is to be generous to our communities. And with Higginbotham Helps, I feel that we can actually live that value. What has been so wonderful about Higginbotham is that they actually, um, you know, reached out to us, thought about us um, as some of those frontline workers. We are so grateful for um, all of the frontline workers that have been out there during this pandemic. Um, and we know that obviously healthcare is one of the biggest ones. They're, you know, putting their lives on the line every day to help um, those that are, um, you know, have been diagnosed with COVID-19. Um, so many people have, of course, recognized them and it is well-deserved um, as well as, you know, even grocery store workers, but people forget about, you know, social work and social services and our job is essential too. And so we are here to help those survivors every single day. And we have been through this entire pandemic. When COVID-19 hit in March of uh, 2020, it, it really just devastated my business, a lot of food businesses, and even more so though, families and students who many were going to school to get like the one meal a day that they get to eat. And since school was closed, well, what were they doing? Not everybody had access to go pick up food. And so we thought we had to do something. Um, we reached out to the community. We asked for volunteers. We asked for sponsors and donations. And we asked for support. And one of the very first companies that came by and said, how can we help, was Higginbotham. They came with an army of volunteers. They wrote a check to help us provide food for 1,500 people. And because of the support of companies like Higginbotham, we were able to gain enough support to create a, a new project where we're feeding 150,000 people in the nine months after COVID. So, uh, you know, we're seeing things start to come back, but during that really hard part, it was companies like Higginbotham that, that stepped up, they wrote the check, they said, we are committed because, you know, helping each other, that's built into the fabric, into the DNA of us here in Fort Worth, and I just can't thank Higginbotham enough. Higginbotham Helps has served 16 different cities, and on behalf of Higginbotham, we'd like to thank our first responders. Thank you, first responders. Thank you, nurses. Thank you so much. We love all of our essential workers. We're so grateful for you. Higginbotham would like to thank our partnering restaurants for serving the communities during the pandemic. Thank you, small business owners. Thank you, frontline workers. Higginbotham is generous to our communities. And with the Higginbotham Helps Initiative, we have served 17,000 meals across 16 communities. Thank you, restaurant owners. So I just wanna to say to all of our sponsors, all of our donors, all of our volunteers over these 28 weeks, thank you so much. Thank you to Higabotham especially for connecting us with Standard Meat and Chicken Express and writing a check so we can feed thousands of families and bring so many volunteers. And thank you, Higginbotham Helps.